So this is Mexico City, Progreso. It is popular for its culture and its vendors. Many Americans and migrants cross the border for their cheap items to hang out, have more freedom, and it's a different environment. In the next pictures, I will show the living standards in Mexico City. Here is a mother selling chicles to the public as she holds her daughter. This reminds me of how mothers will do anything for their children to get ahead, working for one's daily needs. These are items that people from Mexico make, man handmade and man-made, like rings, purses, bracelets, and wallets with your name on them, to sell to the people who cross, as we are known as gente que tiene dinero. These people in Mexico work all day long, no matter the weather conditions, seven days out of the week. Here is a young man cleaning shoes as a daily job. Here I am giving the elderly lady pesos, as you can see she doesn't have much. Here there is a baby taking a nap outside mother's workplace. The culture in Mexico reminds me to reminds me to appreciate what I already have, to take advantage of the opportunities like my education, because if it wasn't for me having papers, I probably would have had the same lifestyle too. These people live in a city where it can be very stressful, loud, and dirty. Ultimately, these people also have an American dream. Even though most families are in need of shoes, clothes, necessities, they still manage to succeed one way or another. Mexico City becomes an adaptation where families have to accept and make the best out of it, and it is by selling, begging, or having an education that can make them improve in their lifestyle. Here we have a man and his wife asking for 50 cents to use their home bathroom. My parents were born and raised there, and I lived in Mexico City, plus I have family there also. Therefore, Mexico City is a daily reminder of, res of, of respecting my culture and the people. We all aim for success, and some have it harder than others.